About a ton of rubbish is being fished out by Penang Island City Council workers from the log boom in Sungai Pinang daily. The majority of rubbish comprise plastic waste as well as big items such as sofas, bed frames, and refrigerators. Also found among the rubbish were dead marine life. The cleanliness issue of Sungai Pinang is nothing new. It was once touted as one of the ten dirtiest rivers in the country. State Infrastructure Committee Chairman Zaril K. Johari attributed the situation to the attitude of people who continue to throw their rubbish indiscriminately. Zaril said the soon-to-be-implemented Sungai Pinang Flood Mitigation Project may be able to address the rubbish issue in the river. Maksudnya air longkang tak akan masuk ke dalam sungai. So sampah pun tak masuk dalam sungai, dia akan masuk dalam ni lah. Tapi sampah masih ada lah, which is still a problem lah. <laughs> kan? But that will help to improve the quality of Sungai Pinang River. Jadi kita sengaja minta dimasukkan skop dalam RTV Sungai Pinang untuk meningkatkan kualiti Sungai Pinang. That is part of the scope. Even though RTV Sungai Pinang is a flood mitigation project, walaupun dia projek tempatan banjir, kerajaan negeri juga minta dimasukkan skop untuk membersihkan Sungai Pinang. Caranya adalah untuk dengan membuat parallel drain yang di mana municipal water, ya, air perbandaran, air dari longkang-longkang akan masuk dalam parallel drain dan tak masuk ke dalam Sungai Dia. Dia basically bypass lah. Dengan itu kita harap Sungai Pinang akan jadi lebih bersih, <laughs> lebih bersih uh, dan. Uh...